Welcome back to another episode of Your Tasty Life TV. I have the pleasure again of being joined with, by Dr. Cindy Soliday. Thank you so much for being here Thank again. You, you are a wealth of information. I'm going to tap you again today for some more information. I want to talk to you about this whole notion of energy medicine or energy psychology. And there's a lot of kind of speculation. When, when some people hear the term energy medicine, mm -hmm. they think it's kind of like some woo woo -y, maybe right. even some shyster kind of stuff. They're not quite sure what that is right. or what would energy medicine type modalities be. So could you speak to that a little bit? Yeah, so let's simplify it mm -hmm. so that it's not woo-woo out there yeah. and bring it into real people, real terms. And I think it's as simple as this as we talk about it in terms of your tasty life. Mm -hmm. And that is, food is energy. Is it not, Lisa? Yes, it is. And it gives us energy. And we use and um, explain a lot about our nutrition as far as energizing, mm -hmm. right? Great point. And I think we all kind of um, unconsciously or intuitively recognize that energy is a part of so much, if mm -hmm. not all that is in our life. And um, that's kind of it. I mean, energy medicine, energy psychology, energy healing modalities of all different names and types recognize mm -hmm. um, that everything is energy. Um, everything in the universe is energy. Right. And um, it's an important component of an integrative or more holistic approach mm -hmm. to um, health care and self-care sure. and life in general. So even a day like today, we're sitting out on a beautiful day mm -hmm. and the sun provides energy. Great energy, right? Yeah. So grounding, this whole thought of putting mm -hmm. your bare feet on the ground, absorbing the earth's energy. Right. So being in nature is one way we could look at just receiving energy. Right. Just like we're out here today, this is one of the best energy medicine practices any of us can do. And they mm -hmm. technically, Lisa, call mm -hmm. it earthing. Mm -hmm. There's a real popular book out now um, entitled Earthing. And simply um, putting your bare feet on the earth, um, mm -hmm. being in nature will transform you into this healthy resonance with the planet, with mm -hmm. the cosmos. I mean, you can keep it as simple as you want to, or you can get really complex. I mean, come on, you guys. Everybody knows the formula sure. E, capital E, equals MC squared. Mm -hmm. Einstein gave us that a long time ago, sure. and we apply that in different areas of our life. But we're so used to separating mm -hmm. ourselves from nature. We're so used to separating the mind from the body. God forbid the emotions. That's a whole other right. thing, which, by the way, Emotions, capital E, dash motion. Emotions are nothing more than energy, energy and motion. motion. And that's what um, energy psychology, sure. energy medicine, energy healing practices okay. um, focus on. Reconnecting to nature, Your emotions. Uh, to our natural state, okay. to our emotions, and beginning to master um, again, the connection mm -hmm. in all of that. And um, I just found it to be absolutely vital in the mm -hmm. work that I do as a, a person sure. in the world, as a spiritual being in the cosmos. And um, I can't separate it from the work that I do with uh, people who come to see me for assistance. So mm -hmm. if you want to see me, we're going to do a little energy work. We're going to mm -hmm. deal with so some explain, emotions. explain a little bit more on that. When you say energy work, yeah. what, what would that mean? Because people might think, ooh, what ooh, is she going to do with energy yeah. work? What, what does that mean? Well, we're just going to we're, um, we're gonna talk about these ideas, these concepts that have been around for thousands of years. I'm going to teach you some basics and the okay. understanding of energy and how the universe is put together, including... We roughly, in general, believe that the universe can be divided into three basic layers or okay. levels, consciousness, energy, and matter. The earth, our bodies, mm -hmm. physical matter, but behind that is energy, and behind energy is consciousness. Where consciousness flows, energy goes, and matter is created. And when you begin to understand that, you can begin to, um, again, embrace a more integrative, holistic view of our place in the universe and how to work with it. Energy practices in particular look at the energy of food, the energy of the earth, the mm -hmm. energy of all things that you surround yourself with. And yes, some people do talk about crystals and yeah. flower essences and music and a, okay. a lighting and a whole, kind, sure. uh, a whole bunch of other things. But I like to kind of focus in on three main energy systems that okay. have been identified um, in Chinese medicine and other energy approaches. This is information that's been around for thousands of years. Mm -hmm. Those three systems are the chakras. Mm -hmm. And in general, we um, 
agree that we have seven main chakras. The meridians, again, in general, we agree that we have 14 meridians, okay. uh, two central and 12 um, other uh, meridians throughout the body, and then a biofield, which a lot of people might recognize your aura, right? Mm. That energy field that radiates off of us. Okay. So if you have any kind of block or any kind of dysfunction or disruption in any of these energy systems or energy fields, then it can lead to dis-ease, mm -hmm. you know, disorder and dysfunction. And by correcting the functioning mm -hmm. of your energy system, which we can do a lot of different techniques that I'll teach you when you come to see me or mm -hmm. we can talk about it in okay. a whole nother video. But by restoring um, healthy energetic functioning, you can restore healthy overall functioning. Okay. And that's the whole point and purpose in adding that into the work that we do. Well, thank you, Dr. Cindy. You really You're gave welcome. a really enriched simplified version i think of what energy work I might entail so. yeah and thank you again so much for sharing that information with us we'll catch you in the next episode of your tasty life tv